What's up YouTube, this is Prince at ATP 101 and Apple has just released 9.3.2 Beta 1. So 9.3.2 Beta 1 for all developers. And if you're not a developer, I'm going to show you guys how to get it. So this is my iPhone 5S right here, plugged in to iTunes. And I have a link in the description to where you could get the firmware, the 9.2 um, Beta 1, 9.3.2 Beta 1, sorry. So let's show you right now that I'm on. Let's go to about. Basically, I'm on 9.3.1. So I'm going to show you guys how to get 9.3, 9.3.2 beta one. So <coughs> link in the description. Download the firmware, and then you want to open up iTunes. And then well, after you download it, you want to save it to the to the desktop. So to save, save the firmware to desktop, and I always advise you guys to use Safari to download the firmware because certain other browsers will give you a zip file, but Safari give you the original IP IPSW right here, so 9.3. And depending on the phone you have, right now this is the iPhone 5S, and if you can look closely on the back, it says like 50, model A. 1533 so when you go to the website you want to use that to reference um, which firmware you're going to download so, all right, so let's open up back iTunes and right here it says check for update we're going to hit shift check for update if you're on Mac if you're on um, Windows if you're on Mac it's going to be option and then check for update and it's going to prompt you to select the firmware that you're going to get so I'm going to hit I'm going to hit um, option because I'm on a Mac, if you're on Windows, it's going to be shipped. So I'm going to hit Option, check for update, and then it prompts me to go to the desktop and it'll search for the firmware. So I want the 9.3 Beta 2. 9.3.2 Beta 2. Beta 1. I keep saying 2. Sorry, guys. It's 9.3.2 Beta 1. So this is it right here, as you can see. Then we're going to hit Open. I hit update and obviously your phone got to be plugged in you can see the bar right here extracting software and guys basically all you got to do after you do that just let it run and it will come back after everything is done it will prompt you and you will set up your phone and this way you won't lose any of your data if you do the update version does it shift update or option update then you won't lose any of your data if you if you did shift like restore then your phone will restore it will still get the firmware on there but you will lose everything have to start up as new so so it run for a little bit So there you go. Waiting for an iPhone. Prepare an iPhone. So I'll come back after this whole process is done, guys. So we're almost done. So the phone gonna reboot. And we should have um, 9.3.2 beta 1 on here. The iPhone 5S. So this is my test device right here. I mean my 5S. My main phone right here. iPhone 6S. This I'm keeping. Uh, I'm still on 9.2 on this one. So it's not jailbroken. I'm keeping it right where it's at. But for now, let's, let's use my iPhone 5S as the dummy. Let this thing reboot. Slide to upgrade. Put in my password.
Come on. Now we could unplug our phone basically because everything done, everything now is just being done on the phone. Slide to unlock, put in my password, and there we go, guys. Let's go to general about, and there you go 9.3.2. So that's how you get 9.3.2 beta 1 on your device, guys. And it's not really new, there's no new features on here other than there's nothing new really so if you want it that's how you get it and there's nothing really new different from 9.3.1 so yeah if you want it there you go you could get it just like that it's printed today TP 101 rate comment and definitely subscribe for more videos like this peace thanks for watching